let's say you're driving out in the middle of the desert, middle of the night, it could be anywhere, and your car has the low engine oil level comes on. What do you do? You're on the middle of nowhere. So here we're in front of 7-Eleven. We're gonna come back to the automotive section. It's over here by the marshmallows and the, and the water and stuff. And here we have to choose, here is the, I found the automotive section. And here we've got a couple different oils. We have 5W20, 10W40, some more, some different 5W20. The, the main difference is this does not have Dexos. Some automatic transmission fluid, some 5W30, and some 10W30. So, so if this was my, so I drive, uh, if I was driving to Las Vegas and this happened out in Baker, California, and I was driving my wife's 08 GL450 Mercedes, I would pick an oil, the, the factory oil should be 5W40, which is a mobile one, um, or anything with the Mercedes Benz designation 229.5 on the back of it. But here's the problem, we don't have that option here. But we're in the middle of the desert and the oil's low. So we still need to do something about it. Uh, if it was my car, like I said, Mercedes, I would pick something without Dexos. So see that Dexos logo, D-E-X-O-S. That's mostly for uh, General Motors vehicles. I would go with, uh, there, here's a 520 without Dexos. That's a little too thin for the German car. Uh, here's, here's, if they had regular 5W30, I would pick 5W30, but again, that has Dexos. Um, I would consider either 10W30 or 10W40. I would probably pick the 10W40 and go ahead and put this in my car. Uh, so that would be, like if you had a Euro car, I would pick this 10W40. If you had a Japanese car, so like Honda, Acura, uh, Nissan, um, I would pick the 5W20, um, or if there was 0W20 on the shelf, I would pick 0W20. Um, if you had an American car, like GM, Dodge, or Ford, um, I would pick any of these with Dexos, 5W20, um, 5W30 with Dexos. Again, you're in the middle of the you're in the middle of the desert, in the middle of it doesn't matter. You could be in the middle of a highly populated area, but in the middle of the night, and all you really have is like a, a Quickie Mart food store to choose from, where you either you have frappuccinos on one side, and you have oil on the other. This is going to be your standard option. You don't have a whole lot to choose from. Uh, so that's I, I would do it within that order. Put something in the car to bring that oil level back up to from, if it says add a quart, add a quart. Uh, don't add more quarts than a quart. Just put, put one quart in at a time.